Absolutely want to make sure I'm recording. <clears throat> oh crap, we have an audience. <clears throat> oh wait, uh, gotta read my script that I'm totally at living. Uh, so anyway, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time zone you're in. Welcome back to The Medium, part 8. Of course I knew what I was going to say. I just wanted to change it up and not do the same exact thing over and over again. Alright, so let's pretty much start with the beginning. I like the... You guys already know I have an ebb and flow. So there's a beginning, middle, and end. My beginning. Do my good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and whatever time zone you're in. Then, I either A, go straight to the game, explore my history, or B, I basically talk about the latest gaming news for just a few minutes, or it could go over 20 minutes, and then head to the game. I mean... PlayStation Plus Extra and Premium are releasing pretty much games from, where are they releasing? Oh, October 17th, when, <laughs> ironically, the medium, and the quarry leaves. But I finished the quarry, so no love loss on that, but I don't mind playing the quarry for, like, a few more videos, then we'll move on. But I left the quarry in a good spot, luckily. Okay, so besides that, and then the metal is basically me offering commentary, genuine reaction, genuine reaction to horror, or genuine reaction or well, analytical thoughts. That's my middle. And I basically hit it at the 50 minute mark or more, or we get to an hour, and then I say a good morning, good afternoon, good evening, in a very heartwarming, bittersweet way, and then we move on to the next video, or next project. i kind of been doing this for a couple of years now, so I guess I kind of have an ebb and flow, I know what my audience like, new or returning subscriber, new or returning viewers. I think I just got used to the YouTube game, so I kind of know what ebb and flow. Not saying that I am not open to feedback and the comments that you guys leave and all that. If they're rude comments, I'm going to totally freaking ignore you and move on. But if they're actually genuine and actually give me constructive feedback, then I'm going to actually listen. Did I kind of... Was I being meta on my own channel? In my videos? You better freaking believe it. Alright, so let's go to basically the PlayStation Plus Extra and Pretty uh, Let's see what they got. Gotham Knights. Gotham Knights. Sorry, I had to take a pause for a few seconds because they built it up too. That's what was disappointing about Gotham Knights. It's basically Batman's sidekicks. And it was an open world. And it literally had possibly, I don't know if it was the Arkham City or Arkham fighting style. And then they totally bob. It's like they had an actually legit project that looked cool. And then they screwed it up. Well, at least it's free. At least it's free on PlayStation Plus. I might do that one. Because, luckily, I have a Batman playlist. But that's for the either great or legendary Batman. That's pretty much, that Batman is pretty much specifically for the Batman Telltale series and the Batman Arkham series. It's not being touched. I refuse to put Gotham Knights in there. No, I'm sorry, you can't convince me. It's going to get its own separate playlist and you can't convince me otherwise. Moving on. Disco Elysium The Final Cut. Excellent game. Highly recommend it. But guess what? I own the game, so I can take all the time I want. Ha! Okay, uh, the Dark Pictures Anthology House of Ashes. Wasn't there, like, five of them now? Or, or are we on four? I know the Devil Inside, or the, was it the Devil in Me, or Devil Inside? I, it's some new one that looked like it sucked, but I heard and looked at the reviews of the House of Ashes. They say that one's good. So... Kind of curious. Hmm. So, might have to get back to the Dark Pictures anthology, finish up those, uh, I guess, two anthology I'm on, and then we'll move on to this one. Okay, cool. Well, we got three games. Maybe we'll get a fourth one. Who knows? So, that one's I'm, I'm kind of interested in, because I only heard good things. Elliot Isolation is the next one. I have it, so there's no rush to play it. Uh, yeah, yeah, I actually bought it, and I actually have it. Enjoyed it. For once, it's actually a legit alien horror game. But we're not. 
De Island Definite Edition. Pass. No, I am actually going to play it. And I actually have it on the Xbox 360. And this is the Definite Edition, so I know it's going to suck. Moving on. Outlast 2. Also own it, so there's no rush on it. Because I own pretty much all the Outlast, once I think about it. Elite Dangerous. It's a massively multiplayer space epic. That is it. So wait, is it like No Man's Sky, or is it like Starfield? I mean, we have so many of them at this point. Hmm. 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 I don't know. I don't know. I, I, I kind of want to check it out. I kind of want to check it out. But yeah, is that weird? I'm curious. Far, Changing Tides. Emotional journey of a boy to ship to find a new home. Um, hmm, hmm, uh, we'll see, we'll see. Uh, Gun Grave Core, pass it, passing, passing. I only heard bad reviews. It built it up like it was going to be cool. And I love the, that's the thing, I love the Gun Grave anime show. I thought it was great. I thought it was awesome. Well, it wasn't awesome, but it was great. I enjoyed it for what it was for the anime. But sadly, translating to the game, it, it's it's not doing well. Well, at least I had the anime in my memories. I'm not playing it. Sorry. Elder Souls. It's a Souls-like. It is basically a Souls-like. I don't know if it's like Dead Souls. I don't know if it's actually like Souls-like like from software. But it has Souls-like. You got me convinced. Roki. I'm just reading it. I'm reading what this is about. Um, okay. I mean, I wasn't interested, but yeah, let's let's check it out. Let's see what this is all about. We'll, we'll check it out. And then that's pretty much it for the extra. Pretty, um, Taken 6. My, uh, was it my least favorite Taken? I appreciate Taken 6 for its story context, for where it is, but I... I I'm sorry, it's, it's not the worst Taken to me, but it's not the best Taken. But I, compared to all the other Takens that I'm in a rush to play all the time, like including Taken 7 and Taken 8, I'm excited about that. You better freaking believe it, yes. Taken 6 was not that Taken game that I was in a rush to play. It, it was, sadly, how many minutes have I done? Eight minutes, darn. Well, we're at the rush this. Uh, Soul Calibur Broken Destiny. That's a spinoff. Ape Escape Academy. Man, my gosh, somebody really likes Ape Escape. I mean, it's a fun game, I just haven't actually taken the time. IQ Final. That is it. That is literally it. Well, it's not disappointing, but I don't know. They could have probably... If they really, really want to stick it in there, they... Ah, uh, no, that sounds... They could have did a Resident Evil game. I guess they did, but... They could have maybe just gone for Resident Evil 6? I mean, sorry, 8. I mean, they could have. Alright, well. Eh, it is what it is, I guess. Alright, well, let's get started. Okay, so the last level was in... Now, this is the level. Even though the last level was not... I mean, it was pretty... <laughs> pretty close with the monster. Pretty freaky, but... Not too bad. Well, no, wait. Was it not too bad? No, no, it's pretty freaking terrifying. Oh, this... Why are you making me do this? It freaks me out every... No, it's not freaking me out. Ah, I hate this every time. Disgusting, 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 disgusting. Especially when there's blood. It's just... It's something so wrong with this. Richard? Are you there? Oh, 
sheet of music. Well, at least part of it. I mean, I'm curious enough. I'm curious enough to find. I, I always like finding music sheets. That's just me, though. Okay, so what is this like a combination? Sun Hill, a little bit of Resident Evil? That's a horse. Gather up, children. I want you to meet Lilian. She's going to be joining our painting class. Uh, why can't I play with my friends, Uncle Richard? Your friends? Oh, Lilian, I. I promised your father you would spend some time with the other children. Friends. Huh? That's a little creepy. Okay, so this... I thought it was the last level, so that's my mistake. But no, it's this level. So this is where... And I'm gonna, of course, go ahead and throw this trigger warning because even IGN is saying that in the walkthrough. The following issue makes reference to and heavily applies physical, emotional, and sexual abuse. While there are no direct or specific uh, uh, specific examples mentioned, we suggest you proceed with caution. I already knew this game was dark, so it's nothing new. Okay. I guess not. Yeah, the way that Sandus was talking in the last video, I was just kind of going like, hmm, what did Richard do to her specifically? And just because the level is talking about, yeah, sexual abuse, I don't like the implications. Yeah, the medium is a dark game. Is it darker than the quarry? Yes, 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 absolutely. If you basically can compare... I mean, when you really think about it, when you really, really, like, compare the themes to basically the quarry and the medium, oh yes, the medium is absolutely... I did not even pay attention to that. That's my bad. And of course, I have no powers or any well. Don't you think he would be better off in a nursing home? What about his family? Richard doesn't have any family. Oh, the poor man. It's like he's somewhere else we were close once you know i mean not that close but all right i'll take care of him hollow like a puppet isn't that what sadness said hmm, hmm. she did say that now uh in terms of voice acting which one's better when it's not Troy Baker or uh, Marianne or specific characters, then the voice acting is actually great. But with man, without Troy Baker, this would not. I don't think it would have got on any wise radar. And the fact that it kind of took some like Akira who did the Silent Hill soundtrack that was probably a great move. Yeah, he, he his soundtrack is phenomenal in this one. Okay, what's over here? Hmm. 
Hmm. Apparently the second music sheet is on a desk. There are the flowers. So is it nearby? Game aids nearby. Hold on. I said that was here. Interesting. Okay, so it's kind of like a... Wait, did I fall in the wall inspiration? Uh, oh no, a whale inspiration. Got it. I'm 
must have missed it. Where the heck is it? It's kind of annoying me. No, I guess not. Of course it is. The equator. Spirit walking. Wait, is that a trophy for being outside my body for 10 minutes straight, or just like separate times? Hmm. Man, PlayStation, sometimes you guys can be trolls, and I love them for it. Alright, time to solve this puzzle by looking at IGN and yay. I saw something. Swear. I did it. Okay, resemble a face. Okay, so... Looks like eyes, a nose, and a mouth? Okay, so we can smooth the eyes up once. There we go. Move the nose up once. Oh, no, I'm not even on That looks like my nose. Okay. Alright, according to IGN, it's Okay, so moving the eyes out, the mouth moves down. When I move the nose out, the eyes move down. I guess eyes move up. Okay, so that's where the mouth goes down. And then we have to move. The nose is up top, the eyes is in the middle. Oh!
remove the ice spice. And one more time. And move to up twice. Wow, ZZ. Another junction. Yeah. Maybe it can show me a way out of here. Okay, now we can skin, literally spin the globe, spin the world. Haha! <laughs> okay, so, spin the globe until the back of E. Access clear. So. Same simple enough. The auto save literally does it now. All right, so the monster is showing up here. I still don't have a name to the monster. I guess we're going here. Ah, spirit well. Oh no, it's a piano. Play me a song, dear Panano man. Give us a song tonight. Are we all in a dream to the piano man? Okay, you get the idea. Alright, some memory shard. And a key. Uh -huh. Interesting. Seriously, the puzzles are really clear. Not yet. I am also using the IGN walkthrough. Obviously, I would never figure this out without figuring this out. Hey, what's all this about? Yeah, I guess we... That makes sense. So we have to return to the room that's locked in the real world. Oh, that's clever. Uh, oh. Well... I guess it's blocked? Oh, because the globe... So we literally have to... Spin it around. Well, that's clever. We out of here. I thought we were. Nope, I guess not. Hold on. Got a kitty now. Like, pretty much like a Resident Evil game. Open sesame.
is this? Come on, Richard. You were always there when I needed you. Let me return the favor. Ah, uh, I don't know, Thomas. What about my work? The university? Richard, I know they kicked you out. I'm guessing you finally managed to piss off the right people. Stay with us, old friend. Do it for me. For them. So, he brought him here. Hmm. Wonder who he meant by them. Who's them? Yeah, the plot thickens. Interesting. Oh yeah, let's get the ported objects first. This music she is. Huh. Well, we'll see. If it's Moonlight Sonata, you know this is a callback to Resident Evil. I highly doubt they would do something. How you found him? Yes. He was just lying there. He, uh... Mr. Echo? I, I'm sorry. He was a friend. I just... Uh, need a moment. That's not true, Thomas. You thought he... deserved it. Yeah, he did say that. The plot thickens again. Just before I leave this room, I want to make sure I got the collectibles. Uh, yeah, Thomas is, was not exactly noble, but I don't know if Richard was exactly noble too. Just want to make sure I got everything from this room before I finally leave. Globe and the puzzles are absolutely clever. I will give it that. Perfect. Now let's go play the piano. Sing us a song tonight. I'll be Okay. Well, that was neat. Well, at least it wasn't Moonlight Sonata. Make your progress.
I love this melody. It reminds me of my childhood. Or at least the good parts of it. But the bad parts, they're always there, aren't they? You're a very smart girl, Lily. You know that, don't you? You're special. Yeah. Her voice, is that sadness? Yeah, I know. It sounds like sadness. And I don't like the way that Richard's talking. I love this melody. At least but you're a you The way that Richard's talking is kind of freaking me out. I don't like the implication. I, I don't just the way he's talking, it's freaking me out. Like Like something like he's giving some like pedo vibes. Anybody else getting that feeling? Well, they did say there would be possible sexual abuse and physical and mental. Still makes me feel uncomfortable. Okay, so this is like a shortcut. Bravo game, bravo. I think we explored everything we could in this, so let's just keep going then. Alright, just gotta remember I can run with the spirit shield. Myself. Wow, that is quite a lot of them. Well, good thing I can go to the spirit well any time. So this would suck. Seems like there was only one path there, like to get through it. Gosh, there's so many bosses to flay, literally. Alright, so we literally had to go through them and go up the stairs from what I could briefly see. Good to know, good to know. Doesn't look like any more moss. Okay. Where this is going. Let's 
trying to get it. Oh. Uncle Richard, my arms are getting tired. You've been drawing me for hours. Almost done. You know, Lily, you remind me of someone. A girl I knew when I was very young. Did you love her? Yes. With a young, innocent love, free of the... ferocity of adult lives. Richard? I'm getting a weird vibe from him. Yes. Yeah. Grief, sorrow, and... something else. Yeah, I don't think we want to reach into that thought. The way he's talking, I don't like the implication. Yeah, it young, probably young isn't love, but it ain't innocent now. Ooh. Hey, what's this? Ah, okay. We got a trophy for it. Cool. What's this say? Okay. Interesting. Something's that not yet. Four minutes, I believe it. Okay, so I heard that's beneath the overhanging balcony. Did I miss it? Maybe I did. Uh, I'm, I'm looking. Just to be sure. Not a lot of energy, but I'll make it work. I'm gonna try to find this collectible. If I can try to find collectible and get a hundred percent, I'll try, but if I can't, that's okay. I mean, it's 12, so we really got only five more days for the medium. Sadly, because I'm enjoying the crap out of this game more than I should. Sadly, no one's really going to play this game, and that's okay.
Okay, so it is in that open area. So I, I was on the right path. I'm trying to find the mentor's diary. It's not ne it's not needed, but it's kind of like good background. I think I see something over there. I'm just not sure. Let's look back there. If we can. At least I thought it was there. What do you guys expect? Of course I'm going to be thorough of where I'm looking, because the collectibles are actually engaging enough and well written that I actually give a damn. I would like to earn a platinum on this game. I, I just know before the 17 I'm, I'm not. Sadly, I'm not. It would be cool. It would be absolutely cool, because I'm enjoying the crap out of this game, and I highly recommend it. Yes, there's nothing. I thought so. I thought there was something. I thought I could cross over, but eh, I guess not. I guess that was the note. Even though I didn't think that was a no, but I, I guess it was. Oh, well, I want to be thorough, just in case. Ah, uh, hold on a minute. Alright, now let's interact with this doll. What is going on now? Uh, I don't like where this is going. I really don't like where this is going. Aren't you a bit old to be playing with dolls? Here, I bought it especially for you. Oh, a ribbon? It's beautiful. Thank you, Uncle Richard. Yeah, let me... Um, on the other hand, why don't you do it yourself? Ah, uh, what was that? It's like something stirred inside him. Yeah. It's like he's grooming her. I don't like the implication. No, it, it's... It's like he's grooming her. There are signs, and I don't like this. Okay, it's been 51 minutes. I think perfect way to stop this, not the whole thing. And we can just jump into pretty much part, I guess, part 9? I guess this is part 9. Alright, after this next video. Sweet.